Hello and welcome back to Cariani Farms and we'd like to say thanks for stopping by. Uh, today I want to uh, introduce you to somebody. It's not somebody new, it's somebody that's here on the farm um, and um, we're very proud of her. So uh, without further ado, let's get right into this and I'll introduce you to who I'm talking about. All right, here we go. Welcome to Cariani Farms. We wanted to introduce you to one of our newest members. This is Isabella. She's an American cream draft cross. We adopted her. Her owner passed away and she's from East Tennessee. We believe, according to her genetic testing from Texas A&M, that she is Hanoverian cream draft cross. We believe that her father was a uh, cream and champagne and we know that she has a champagne gene because we tested her um, we do believe as pale as she is she might also be carrying a cream gene which we didn't test for we bred her in september to a percheron stallion and so she is in foal and we're hopeful that there's a 50 percent chance that her foal will be champagne same as her maybe a little more chocolatey we do love her. We love taking care of her. She's got a really sweet personality. I'm not sure if we've shared with you, but she absolutely loves jelly beans and will work for them. Sometimes it's difficult to pick up her feet because they're so heavy, but she'll hold them up an extra bit so you can get her feet done if you give her some jelly beans. We did get her ultrasounded before she was bred and we'll share that ultrasound with you. I don't see any endometrial cells. It's a lot of fluid in there. Although that's going to come, become honestly more important when she starts showing that. We also had her teeth loaded because she needed some of her molars worn down a little bit so that she could digest her food better. We did want to share with you some of the interesting facts about the cream draft breed. Although she's not registered cream draft because she does not have a blonde mane and tail. If she did, we could probably get her registered, but because hers is sort of a caramel color, um, <laughs> they don't, that's not a breed standard, even though she does carry um, champagne and very likely carries cream. Either way, um, we wanted to share a few interesting facts about the breed. The American Cream Draft breed is a heritage breed, and there are only around four or 500 American cream drafts left in the world. They are one of the first draft breeds that were developed in America. And also they're so unique in their beautiful cream color and their 
really big size. With you, some of the reasons that they were bred, they were obviously a large draft breed, so they can pull farm equipment really well. And they're beautiful cream color. Isabella wants to show you all for better size. Oh, yes. <laughs> their docile nature and their beautiful color is kind of unique. Most draft horses don't come in dilute jeans, um, so that makes them really special. Their beautiful caramel kind eyes. We hope that you come along with our journey with Isabella and join us for the next few months. We'll try to keep you posted as things move along. Hopefully she'll shed some of this big thick woolly <laughs> winter coat off and maybe not all on me. She's just a gentle giant. Look at her beautiful eyes. So she'll be doing uh, what? August. August. If she's pregnant, and we hope she is. That's Sage. She got a beautiful long mane. All right, so um, yeah, her favorite treat is jelly beans. Isabella wants jelly beans. Oh, yeah. She likes jelly beans for being a good girl when her feet are picked up. what you see please subscribe to our channel hit the like button and the notification bell so that when we post a new video about Isabella you won't miss it